Absolute Wealth. Real investors, real results. Hubert Sanders here with AbsoluteWealth.com. Let's go through a, a, a little discussion of how you determine value. How do you determine overbought and oversold? So there's several different ways to do it. So in my opinion, this is one of the better ways to do it. So first what you want to try to figure out when you're talking technically, which we are, you first want to figure out if the market is in a uptrend or a downtrend. Now the Dow here is in an uptrend, as you can see an uptrend here and then another uptrend on this side of things. Now, um, if it was in a downtrend, what we would do, if we were in a downtrend, what we would be looking to do is buy these yellow tips wherein it's statistically moderately oversold. So this is oversold, this is oversold, this is oversold. Ideally though, the best place to do it is the red tips because that's when it's extremely oversold. So you can see back here on my mouse pointer, that's extremely oversold. But right now we're in an uptrend, so what I'm starting to see in the past one, two, three, four, five days is these nice little red tips on my value charts indicator, which just tells me that it is statistically extremely overbought. So we need a little bit of a correction here. Now that's been the past five days, and the market continues to go up. So all indicators can uh, continue to be overbought, 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 overbought as the market uh, marches higher so you do need to know that and, but it will give you a good idea of places where you can number one either take profits or number two start to short initiate shorts on stuff so hope that helps good luck hope it helps and I'll see you on the next video